good teacher is truly just someone who not only gives you like the tools to succeed in their classroom, but to take those tools and be able to apply them to life. I think that the best teachers are the teachers that care about their students' education. And I think Dr. McGreevy really cares about the quality of her students' education and educating herself about new advances in how to teach students, which is really cool. On day one when I walked in, in my mind it was my job to teach biology and that's what I had to do. And I realized that so many of my students were facing other things in their lives that they wanted to talk to me about. And so that has informed everything that I do in terms of how do I build my classroom so that every single person feels like they belong there and that they can be successful there. I was talking to Dr. McGreevy about my concerns about being a Latinx in Pittsburgh's community and even though she had a very different past, we still connected on such a like heart-to-heart -heart level. And she's not just the type of person where she says like, oh yeah, I'll listen to you, you matter, but then doesn't hold it up. She will hold it up. She not only just teaches material, she also tries to inspire you more about biology. You know, you sit there and you learn all these things that you need to know for foundations of bio, but you also learn a lot of things that apply to daily life. I want the students to see how the content relates to their everyday life. And so a big part of the curriculum design is not just can you memorize all of these terms and all of this information, but how does this apply to you? The first year course that I teach, the Foundations Large Lecture course, is a course where we see the highest attrition from science. And there's already an issue in terms of representation in science. And I feel like that's a course where I do have the biggest opportunity to impact who we see entering science fields. And so for my students, I want them to learn in that first semester that, yes, science can be really hard, right? Being a scientist is hard, but anyone can do it. And the struggle and the failures that come along with being a scientist are just part of the process. A lot of students come into Bio 1 and they think they're gonna fail. And so having a professor look you in the eye and say, you can do this is really impactful. Dr. McGreevy really made biology an accessible subject by providing us a lot of competent UTAs. And outside of class, she provided plenty amounts of office hours so that students would never feel that they were constricted because of their class schedule. And those little things go a long way. The community of students is incredible in that we have some really passionate, really motivated students that want to learn, they have big dreams, and all they really need is a push to get there, and they want to help each other get there. And that's something I've seen through this teaching assistant community that we've built, is that when you give a student an opportunity to help other students to be successful like they were, they love that. She is truly someone who cares about every single student that's in her class, regardless if you are the A student or if you are the one who's trailing behind. She makes people feel really comfortable. And so it's just been fun to watch a woman in science who's so accomplished and see how she's accomplished that. It's just because she works really hard and she cares about her students. And so I think no matter what I end up doing, right now I'm planning to go to med school, if I work really hard and care about my patients or care about my coworkers the way that I really see her build people around her up, I'll have a pretty fun time. I think the number one most important thing that I hope a student gets from my course is confidence in their ability to be successful as a biologist. And so I try to emphasize in my classroom that struggle's good, you know? If something's hard, that's great. That means you're learning, right? And so confidence and a sense of belonging as a scientist. I want students to feel like they are scientists and they can think like scientists and they can do the things that scientists do.